Long after Sunday's celebration wound down, the champions were still feeling very good on Monday. You like my attire? You, I should have worn pink at some point. You're still wearing the suit. I can't, I can't get off. This is, I'm going to be sleeping, waking up in the morning. Let me tell you, this has been amazing and uh, what a great partnership with Mike and uh, Jim as well. Great group of guys today taking the pictures. You can see everybody's really want to be part of this and um, I'm so glad to be the, the guy uh, to, they gave me the tools, I just execute. For Meyer Shank Racing, the team's first IndyCar race win comes in the world's biggest race. The addition of Elio this May coming together for an epic victory. It's incredible. I mean, I grew up all my life wanting to win this. He's won at three, now four. Uh, we, we did this very specific. We talked a lot of six, eight months ago. We wanted someone to come and help our Speedway program, especially here. But overall, it's turned into much more than that already. So he brings a lot to the table. Doesn't matter where we're at. He's been at every race leading up to this thing. So uh, we got everything we wanted out of him more. The 500's runner-up climbed out of the car Sunday with that initial disappointment of coming so close. In that moment, what are you feeling in that moment to come that close? I had the best car yesterday. Um, I don't know if next year we're going to still have the best car, maybe better, or it's not going to be my day. Um, and I felt like yesterday was my day, um, but it was Elio's day. So um, it, was, it was bad the first three minutes when I jumped out of, of the car and I was like, oh, sorry, boys. And all the crew was super happy, like, hey, guy, uh, hey, man, like you were fighting until the last lap for the Indy 500 against Elio Castroneves, so uh, you should be proud. But 24-year-old Alex Pelot now leads the IndyCar point standings. Sunday's second place finish will be yet another learning experience. I think he timed it perfectly and um, yeah, I think those 24 more years of experience um, that he has paid off. Elio made the fence climb famous, but on Sunday it was all about the team getting its moment. I mean, we talked about it a little bit jokingly, but to have that up for the guys, right? Like they want to come with them. They, they were there right there. They knew what to do. And uh, it's, it's a piece of history. We're all a piece of history. At IMS, Brad Brown, WRTV Trackside.